Hello everybody and welcome to our channel VR Games. It is me, I'm Monique and Biscuit. Hi! <laughs> Hello everybody. Yeah, so today we're going to be here talking about the Oculus Quest 2. Um, just to give our thoughts on the, on the new toy, I would say. Yes, it's going to be our new toy. New toy. New toy. So More powerful good. toy. Yeah, so, so we're going to get right into this. The Oculus Quest 2 will have much more powerful specs than its predecessor. And you know, that is one word I cannot say, predecessor. Very long word. Anyways, the Android based hardware will run on a Snapdragon XR2 chip with 6GB of RAM, a dramatic improvement over the 2017 Snapdragon 835, and 4GB of RAM for the original. From the original, sorry. Blah, 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 blah. You know, I'll get there with this. <laughs> this should allow for more sophisticated games, according to Facebook. It should come with up to 256 gigabyte of hard drive storage. You'll also have a much clearer view of the virtual world. The Oculus Quest 2 will boost a resolution of nearly, and I mean nearly, 2K per eye. So I repeat, that's nearly 2K per eye, or more than 50% more pixels. And it's 50% more pixels than the, the Oculus Quest 1. So that's quite interesting. We'll see how it looks then. This might be a single large display instead of the two from the first quest, but it should still lead to more immersive gaming with less of the screen door effects you get when you can see gaps between pixels. About the design. So the design appears to have been improved as well, with an easier to fit soft touch strap, a new touch controller uh, with the sensor, and it's and the Quest 2 itself is going to, going to be lighter, a smaller headset. It is also expected to offer 3D audio and out of the box Oculus Link support will make the Quest 2 useful as a PC headset. So this is ideal for people running out on Steam and playing all the games available there. Providing you've got a gaming ready PC that is, so yeah. There is no mention of pricing of availability for the Oculus Quest 2. So, we're going to put our guess in uh, on how much I think it's going to be and how much I'm going to think it's going to be. Um, so, for the 64 gig model, uh, my guess it could come to around £400. And for the two, could be, could be, I could be wrong, but I don't know. That's my theory. And for the 256 gigabyte hard drive model, I reckon that could be up to 600 pounds. I hope it's going to be cheaper. So let's hope I do get this wrong and it's cheaper than that. So, but who knows? But once I oh wait a minute before I carry on, I'm neat. What price do you think it's going to be? Even if you want to see it in euro. <laughs> so 64 gig. Five five hundred euro. 500 euro for a 64 gig, that must be pricey. Oh well, we just don't know. We really, really don't know. Uh, but, uh, yes. Also, in the next couple coming days, uh, September 16th, 2020, there will be a Facebook Connect virtual conference uh, to show the demo of the new Oculus Quest 2. So we're quite excited for that. And uh, we'll give you our thoughts on that once we see the demo. So, uh, Yes, uh, I think that a bit covers it so far because we know so little about it, especially with the uh, the leaks that are happening basically. Yeah, so, it's only leaks, so we, yeah, can, absolutely. we can say exactly what will be price and uh, what the headset is going to be and uh, how it will work, it will be better or no, just... You know, it's just our opinion, just only. 
Yeah, so if you've got any thoughts, please leave us a comment on our channel and let us know what you think. Uh, if you like this video, then please click the like button, that'll be appreciated. And if you're new here, why not subscribe and we'll get you some more videos as they come along. So thank you very much guys, and we'll see you later.